Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to find the circle of curvature for the given curve x y is equal to c square at the point c comma c. The formula for finding the circle of curvature is x minus x bar whole square plus y minus y bar whole square equal to rho square and formula for finding x bar is x minus dy by dx into 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole division d square y by dx square. In the same way y bar is y plus 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole division d square y by dx square and the formula for rho which is the radius of curvature 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole power 3 by 2 whole division d square y by dx square. So now we are going to find dy by dx and d square y by dx square for the given curve and we are going to find x bar, y bar and rho and finally we are going to substitute here to get the circle of curvature. So we take the curve xy is equal to c square. xy is equal to c square. We have to use product rule u is equal to x and v is equal to y. So when it is in product rule we use u dash v plus u v dash. So we are going to differentiate this. Differentiation of u dash which is the differentiation of x 1 and we keep y as it is plus u is x and v dash is dy by dx and c square is a constant. So from this x into dy by dx is minus y and dy by dx will be minus y by x and when we find its value at the given point c comma c this becomes minus c by c and that is minus 1. Now again we are going to take this expression and continue the second differentiation that is d square y by dx square for that we will follow u by v method the formula is u dash v minus u v dash by v square and here u is y and v is x. So we keep the minus sign outside. So d square y by dx square equal to minus sign is outside u dash which is the differentiation of u dy by dx into v minus u differentiation is y and v dash is 1. Then whole division x square that is b, b square v is x. Now again we have to find at c comma c. So there is a minus sign outside dy by dx value is minus 1. So we take minus 1 and x is c so into c again y is also c. Then whole division c square and this will become minus c minus c is minus 2c there is a minus sign outside so plus 2c divided by c square after cancelling we get 2 by c now we are going to take x bar and its formula is x minus dy by dx into 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole division d square y by dx square so this will give x is c minus dy by dx is minus 1. So we can make it as plus 1. And this is 1. When we square it is 1 divided by 2 by c. And we can carry the c here. So this will become c plus 2 by 2 into c. Finally this is 2c. c plus c. Similarly y bar y plus 1 plus dy by dx whole square 
whole division d square y by dx square. So this is c plus 1 plus minus 1 whole square is 1 by 2 by c. So again we can carry this here. So this will become c plus 2 by 2 into c. So c plus c which is 2c. Now we have to find the value of the radius of curvature rho which is 1 plus dy by dx whole square whole power 3 by 2 whole division d square y by dx square. So this is 1 plus and we got dy by dx is minus 1 when we square it is plus 1 whole power 3 by 2 divided by 2 by c. So the numerator is 1 plus 1 is 2. So 2 power 3 by 2 by 2 and the c we can multiply here into c and this becomes 2 power 3 by 2 minus 1 because this is power 1 when we take to the numerator it is minus 1 into c. After subtraction 3 minus 2 by 2 which is 1 by 2. So 2 power 1 by 2 into c which is actually root 2 into c. Now we come to the formula we substitute x bar so which is 2c x minus 2c whole square and y minus y bar again y minus 2c whole square equal to rho square. When we square this we get whole square like this. After squaring this will become 2c square. So the final answer is x minus 2c whole square plus y minus 2c whole square is equal to 2c square. This is our required circle of curvature.